they gave us this authority because it's not around. Even Mamish is here, so they allowed me to come and see people. As I said, um, he started the issue of uh, prophetic service. So I'm the one who's uh, holding the prophetic service every Saturday. So right now I'm going to speak with you. And what you can do for me, don't look at me. You know, believe that God is going to turn your life around. You understand my point? Even though there is not here, but God is here. Huh? Do you believe that? Huh? Are you believing? Yes, I believe. <laughs> Amen. 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 So I'll see you now. But uh, I'll be very, very much, I'll enter inside your pocket today. So you, you'll see that God is here. Because I'm going to uh, tell you things that you never thought. Uh, <laughs> so always my father always said to me, speak everything. But I always say to him, I can't speak everything because I'm afraid of TV. You understand? Because you people, you come here with secrets. And uh, so, but I believe God is going to help me, you know, to, to pray for you and speak the mind of God unto your life. So, but you also, we need to pray for a person called Paul. Hmm? My husband. It's my husband. You see? We need to pray for Paul. I saw a person called Paul. That we need to pray for him. And we also need to pray for your family. Because I'm just seeing a lot of attacks. Huh? And now these attacks, they are coming to you now. So when I look at you like this, you are sick. Hmm? You are very sick. Starting from the legs. Give glory to God. Because I'm just, I'm just showing you that even there is not here, God is here. Yeah. So you, we need to pray for a church. No? We need to pray for a church. But you need to be careful about many people that are around you. You understand my point? So I'll pray for you, and I believe what you've been crying for, because what you came here for is the issues of impartation. You understand my point? But I believe with the authority that God has given me, Today I'll pray for you, and you'll see what will happen to you. You understand? Your name is Emmanuel? Yes. Huh? Yes, that's my name. Huh? That's my wife. Is your what? My wife. Because when I'm, I'm going there, I'm hearing a person called Basani. Basani. We need to pray for your marriage. You understand? And I'll pray for you. God will do something today. And everything that has been troubling you, because I just saw... Where is your church? I'm just seeing a church that is, this church is attacked. That is, when it's like it's growing, it's going down. Huh? So I'll pray for you, and you'll make it. You, you, you need to pray. You need to pray, because where I'm seeing Sangomas. It's like where you're married, even where you're coming from, that, these are witches. So you must be very serious with your salvation. Yeah. You understand me? Yeah. So now I believe after today, this legs will be fine. Because this thing now is affecting your heart now. Yeah? I'm seeing a problem of the blood flow. Huh? You went to the doctor. The doctor told you about the blood flow. That your blood is not uh, moving correctly. Yeah, the poor blood circulation.
Amen. Amen. Yes. Okay, I'm Hadi Masikila from Polokwane, Hadi Hale. Today, Kikwile Kitlimo Kiki Kwadi Peini, Moma Otung, all over my body, but now Kifila. Today I came here having points all over my body and right now I feel free. I feel like a weight has been lifted off my shoulders. People are against our marriage. So I have to bring him. Yes. Now, I can say what the pain I can quit looking what you will read. I can go around the same time. I can feel like I'm lost, but I can feel like I'm going to If it lasts a zero, I can do my own. I can go to the after prophet and prophesy, I can say what the pain is. I can get the money to go. I can get free. I
Okay, my name is Emmanuel Kosa. I come from Bozolan village around Malamlele area. Um, actually, the prophecy that had been confirmed today, it was about the impartation. As I visited here at Charles Missionary Church specifically for the impartation as much as I'm in the ministry. Yes, he, he was telling me about the issue of the fact that it's like there is an attack whereby they are attack, trying to attack the work of God there because he saw the ministry growing and sometimes becoming a bit small, just like that. And I confirmed that to be true. Yeah, actually, it, it was... I can't pick up exactly the date, but I, I remember the day I was lying down on top of something which was a bit hard. So after that, I realized that that part of my rib is like it's in pain. You see, so, but something that I was questioning was the issue of the fact that you find that pain continue trying to affect some other areas of your body. And while he was praying with me, he said, it's like the enemy is trying to, is planning actually to attack you with our blood, trying to stop the work of God and the stuff. And that's why I also confirmed to him, as I requested for the permission to say, to say there is this thing that happened after I lied on top of something which was bit hard and I felt this part of the rib being affected. And he told me that that's true because it was the plan of the enemy that he, will, uh, he wanted to attack you. That's why I was saying why the very same thing not coming to the other side but coming straight to the heart because when the heart now get affected, you will become tight so easily. Yes, I, I confirm that to be true. Um, actually, we believe in God's presence. Understanding that whoever's gonna be around will be operating and functioning under the very same grace. Under the very same grace. So if there is not here, obviously the one you're gonna appoint to minister to the visitors is as good as he's here because the same spirit that is, that is upon, that is upon the man will be coming to, to see the visitors there. Um, actually, when we come here, crying for something. Mm -hmm. Sometimes your mind can be focusing only on that area and when you start touching that area mm -hmm. you feel like I've arrived and when you start like going deep with some other issues that's where you realize that you know what I'm in the presence of God here and God is not only concerned with this area that I'm crying for but there are some other areas that the enemy might be planning to attack that can disturb what God wanted to do here. So as much as you will be touching those areas, you understand that it's securing everything that is there to provide, even to give to you. No, I'm feeling so good. I'm feeling so happy. I'm feeling so fulfilled. And I'm looking forward to see God moving so mightily. No, I felt that something was coming upon me because it's after he prayed for me, he, I came to realize that the more he continued praying, it's like he was hearing that he must lay his hand to the point that he ended up saying well, I'm going to do this six times and after that I will be touching your eyes and he that's what he did that's what he did um actually my understanding is that as children of God we need to to learn to look beyond the physical body but looking at the spirit that is at work in someone's heart you see